Hey, what's going on guys? Archer Mark here and back with another Star Wars review. And again, I have another Lego Star Wars set for you. This is the Shadow Troopers Battle Pack. And it's a neat little set. Uh, right off the bat, I am going to say, and this is the case with a lot of Lego sets, but this one is really, you're buying this for the minifigs. Uh, the ship is a nice little bonus, but the, the figures are definitely a standout uh, on this set. And certainly worth for the, the figures alone. Uh, it's a cool little set. We'll get to that in a moment. Let's show you the packaging. Here's the box. Uh, very standard. We got the Lego Star Wars logo there. We have the Star Wars Rebels kind of style Stormtrooper helmet there. And that looks cool. And cool image of the little speeder and the four minifigs and the little fantasy situation there with the missiles flying and zooming around this is for ages 6 to 12 it's set number 75079 shadow troopers 95 pieces so mini set a little bit more around the same size as the micro fighters somewhere in there okay we go on this side not too much there uh, just another same image there Here's a close-up image of the Shadow Stormtrooper. You got two of those. And again, in the back here, Lego Star Wars. And this side showing you the various features. You have the weapon storage for the, the guns. And the flick missiles, which is of course standard for Lego sets. Uh, you get the Disney logo, uh, lego.com slash Star Wars. And again, other little images of the vehicle and the figures. And that's a cool image right there, a little closer up image of the four figures included. Okay, that's about all we could show you. Box, and of course, again, any Lego set has the instruction manual. And, you know, this is a pretty thin manual. There's nothing, there's not much to it. But as, as usual, like any other Lego set, the step-by-step -step instructions, brick by brick, and... They just, uh, you know, take you through the steps and comes together, you know. Fairly standard, but of course very useful in putting these sets together. Get that out of the way. Now, I'm going to show you the vehicle first. A lot of times I start with the minifigs. The minifigs, like I said, are really the highlight of this set. Uh, so this is, I think, a very cool, neat little vehicle. It's, it's a nice addition to go. Uh, with the minifigs. There's a nice contrast of various colors, different color grays and blacks, a little bit of red in there. So it's a nice contrast there. And this looks like it'd be a, you know, a fast little vehicle zooming around some planetscape somewhere. Okay, You see there is room for two of the minifigs to sit, as we have one there. I'll give you a closer look at him in a moment. Here you see the clips here, as you saw in the box, there's the weapon storage for the blasters. And the flick missiles, which for this set, these are in very tight. And it takes a little bit of effort to get them to fire out on this one. Uh, but they, they do fire like all good standard Lego sets. But I do, I do like this little vehicle. It's a, I think it's a neat little vehicle. Uh, Besides the missiles you know, on the front here, I like to I like to believe that these are blaster cannons as well, and you have these little fins here. So those are cool. So a sleek little vehicle. Okay, that's about all we can show you with that. We'll give you a look at the figures. Uh, start with now. You get two of these guys the Shadow Stormtroopers and they're both the same, they both have the same head and this real angry faces, no double printing but nice printing you know it's it's all black you know, it's a black and a light, a dark dark gray um, but you have nice printing on there you know when you have all black sometimes the details can get lost but um, I think they did a good job on this nice printing it's it's basically like uh like what you would see on a stormtrooper but there's something about the 
the black just looks so cool. And give you a look, you saw the one trooper, that they both have the helmets, again the same, the helmets here are really cool, very nicely sculpted. Again, very much like a typical Stormtrooper helmet, just all in that all gray uh, motif. Okay. And they both come with this, the, the newer standard blasters with the projectiles that fire out. And you do get several more of these uh, should you lose them, so those. Okay. And we'll give you a look. Here's, you know, this guy. Get a better look. This guy again. Okay. And then we'll take. And then we have two of these kind of shadow guards. They basically look like the Emperor Royal Guards, but just all black. And they have this cool weapons, kind of a, almost like a, almost like a lightsaber here, and then like a force pike on this end. It's double. Ended weapon, you know, looks very cool, menacing, you know, wouldn't want to end up on the, the business end of this, no. Uh, again, these are all black, there's a little bit of printing you see there, not much. And, see, there's nothing at all on the back, so, very little printing, but these guys, I think, look very cool. Uh, there's no faces at all, there's just like a red head there, there's no face at all, just underneath the helmet. Uh, so no no face to show you there. But still very, very cool. Okay. And yeah, like I said, this set is definitely uh, for the minifigs. You have four very cool looking minifigs. Obviously, you know, two of each, two of the troopers, two of the guards. And, you know, again, the vehicles, it's a nice little addition, so it's that, plus the four great minifigs, I would say it's a great set to pick up. Uh, I think this ran about $15 or $20, somewhere in there. Uh, I don't remember exactly, but great set to pick up. You know, again, one thing with LEGO, I think I've said this before, is LEGO sets are, are not hard to track down. There are so many retailers that sell between Kmart and Target and Walmart, Toys R Us, is, of course, obviously online stores as well. Uh, it's not a difficult, uh, not difficult items to pick up, uh, as opposed to say some certain figures that maybe are store exclusives or whatever. Legos, uh, I think, are fairly easy to to find and track down. So there's my review of the Shadow Troopers Battle Pack, and I think it's a great little set. Uh, you know, if you love the army build, if you love troopers like this, I would definitely pick this set up. It's certainly worth it. Track it down, and you know, it's a great set to, to get. So I hope you enjoyed this review. As usual, comment, rate, subscribe, and until my next video, may the force be with you.